So uh, that old soil machine has been in the water for two years. Uh, it's collected a lot of data for the, the validation of some of the engineering tools. Uh, so the engineering tools which design the blades, which characterise the, uh, the resource and predict the energy. Uh, that was done in conjunction with EDF, with uh, Edinburgh University and, uh, and Rolls-Royce and Eon. Uh, on, the, on the far right hand side, so a set of engineering tools that we uh, developed to predict how wave and tidal devices would perform. Uh, that one was also done with Edinburgh University, Oxford, Queen's University in Belfast, EDF and Eon and uh, Garard Hassan, which is now part of DMV. Now the last ones, um, Smart Tide is an engineering model of um, understanding the interactions between devices and also on a, um, uh, on a it says a UK scale but it's actually on a, a more global scale. One of the things that we found from using Smart Tide was that if we put a barrage, a, a tidal barrage across one of our big rivers, because of the difference in tides that that would produce, we would drown Holland, which is a bad thing. Mm -hmm. The other thing that that showed as well is that we would probably flood London from time to time, which is also a bad thing. Um, and we'd slow the world down as well. <laughs> Only a little bit, but... Uh, so, what that uh, tool does now is to say, this is where you should place the tidal resources and this is how big they can be without detriment on the rest of the environment. Mm. The uh, tech system demonstrator, which is this one here in the middle, is the, uh, is the next phase of looking at innovative tidal stream devices. That one's being built right now. It's a, a three megawatt machine being built in, in Scotland. Um, and it should give a cost of energy uh, which is around about £100 per megawatt hour. And that's for, for two years' time. £100, yeah. Uh, the design life for these things is about 20 years. Well, we say 20 now. Could be longer, but right now our intention is to get to 20 years. And that one also meets the um, the marine roadmap targets as well. That's uh, that's right at the bottom end of the uh, the cost. Uh, the um, the project is being delivered by Atlantis Resources, uh, which have raised a lot of cash on the uh, stock exchange. And they have also um, partnered with Black and & Veatch and Lockheed Martin, two American companies. Atlantis is actually an Australian company. And then the final one is the uh, Palamis, where we looked at um, innovative wave energy arrays. Uh, but actually, rather than an array, we found that the basic device didn't uh, show a clear pathway to significant cost reduction. And that's it on marine energy. I'll wrap it through. <laughs> if you have any questions. <laughs> so thank, you. Thanks. thank you. Give me five. <laughs> You know, in Argentina, we have a, a saying, when we go to America, we don't buy one, we buy two or three or four. Will we get the, your presentation? <laughs> yes, give me five, five, in it. five of these pr small projects. Yes, I can or, see the figure because I, my eyes are not quite good, but so I, I need the, your presentation, right? Yes, of course, I'll, uh, I'll send that along, that's no problem. There's uh, a set of notes underneath as well, so you didn't have to take notes today. A lot of the words that I've said are, are written down underneath. Ah, oh, excellent. Fine. Okay. 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 That's no problem. I have done this lecture before, so uh, there's going to be a lot of terms in some of those notes that uh, I might need to, um, uh, to explain more fully. But I'll do that and we'll, I'll send it to you within the next, uh, well, by Wednesday next week. Okay.
Excellent. All right. Welcome. Any other questions? Uh, you spoke about 20 megabytes to a bias. <laughs> <laughs> yes. When I mentioned graphene. When you mentioned graphene. Yes. I want to speak about 30 megabytes to a bias. Wow. Wow. Right. Uh, we are dealing with an idea that works. I want to show some drafts. Okay. So you criticize them. <laughs> we are free to go. <laughs> so we are free to go. So you see, it's not for you. It's just techniques and things. Uh, and I think it's just pretty much. And I have 20 years. Unless we were officially in Europe.